Hi, hi. We start Halloween season now. Okay? In this household, we start Halloween season early. It gives us more time to play spooky games. Okay? Do I have a cutie on my head? I do have a cutie on my head. <laughs> Oopsies. Hi, hi. Hi, cowboy. You are first. Look. <laughs> Six months of me. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. How you? I'm doing good. I'm a little sleepy just because Baba never lets me sleep at night. But that is the normal for me. And, uh, we're gonna be playing Parasite Eve. <laughs> Parasite Eve, and now I feel old? Don't feel old. It's okay. For people that are unfamiliar with Parasite Eve, let me kind of explain a little bit. Mm. After I take a sippy sippy. Parasite Eve came out on the original PlayStation around the time that the original uh, Resident Evils came out. So, horror Resident Evil type of game. Okay? So if you like that era of games as much as I do, then you're in for a great time. <laughs> um, if it's not your type of thing and you don't like oldish games and old graphics and yada yada then that's okay but maybe also stick around at least for the beginning half to see if it's something that you might be interested in coming back and watching because i used to play this game when i was a wee tiny little sheep boo and i loved it and i haven't played it since i think since i was Maybe nine years old? It, it probably will say the year on this game so that I could do the math and see how old I was. But I'm thinking I was maybe nine-ish years old. I think. But yeah. Halloween season starts now. Because I can't wait any longer. And baby, yes. Protect me, sheep. And no, it's not that scary. It's not that scary. It's okay. It's okay. It's old graphics, so it won't be too scary. If there's a scary part coming up, I'll warn everybody. Like I said, there's a mount there's a part with a rat towards the beginning of the game, uh, a cutscene. So I'm gonna warn people before that part, just in case you don't like rats or don't like gory horror stuff i'll let you guys know before that cutscene happens so you can look away um but other than that i don't think there was much too spooky but we'll see again i haven't played this since i was nine years old so i don't remember a damn thing nom, 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 nom. sheep by the way you're cool thanks I need to join meeting. Be right back. Take your time. Take your time. Not the rat. Yes, 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 yes. The rat. The, the, the rat cutscene. If you're familiar with this game, you know the rat cutscene. Also, hi, hi, guts. <gasps> hi, Tiggy Tiggy. Boo. Hi. Mousus. Yes, Mousus. Mousus. I'm sorry, things happen to the mousus in this game. Okay, shall we start? I hope that the, the people that know this game have a good time watching it again because it's probably been many years. And for the people that aren't familiar with this game, I hope I introduce you to something that uh, you end up really enjoying. Parasite Big Hype. Yeah! I'm excited! Yes, let's go. Game. There we go. There we go, game.
Uh, fun fact, I actually got to play the original way later. I played the sequel first because they didn't release the original in Europe. I played very little of the part two. I think because we didn't own it and I think my sister's friend had it and lent it to us. But didn't really get to play much of it. So I can't wait to play part two uh, eventually as well. 1998. Yes, so I was nine years old! <laughs> yes! Little nine-year-old sheep playing the hallway games. I'll make sure to have a comfort blanket on him. Yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. Don't need to watch that again. The music is jamming. Yeah, it's a good one. Fun fact, this game is actually based on the novel. Oh, I want to read it. I'm going to look for it. In my library. I'm gonna read it. I would love to read it. I'm gonna lurk, sheep. We'll have a good lurk. Thank you for hanging out. I'm sleep. I know. I saw that you were up really late and got very little hours of sleep. Have a good nap, Luke. Snacky, have a lollipop. Thank you. Thank you, Platy. It's one of my lollipops that are bear shaped. They're for babies, but I'm a baby, so it's okay. Mm, the book was released in North America in 2005. Mm. I'm gonna look for it. Thank you for letting me know. I'm gonna take a screenshot so I can look up the name later of that author. Look at these graphics. <laughs> What's wrong? You're the one who wanted to come to the opera. Aya, right? I always used to, when we were little, me and my sister always used to call her Ada. I don't know why, but Aya. Maybe? Aya Bria, 25 years old, NYPD officer. Yes, we are keeping that. Three, I think. Mm. I don't know. I don't know. I just... You're right. I'll try to have more fun. <laughs> I'm so excited. Aren't you glad you decided to go out with me? I even had my dad get the best seats for us tonight. So lighten up. We're gonna have a great time. You'll see. Oh my god. I haven't played this game in years. How do I run? Okay. Circle is run. Triangle is my little menu menu. You know, she got her vest on under her, her coat or whatever and has her club and her gun and whatever. Alright. Alright. Everything is good. Alright. Uh, any other buttons I need here? Not now. No. Probably later. Look at me! Don't mind me, sir. I haven't been here many years. Sir, you have to understand I haven't been here since I was nine. Hello. Hello. Oh, sorry. I didn't read what you said. I clicked too quick. Enjoy the show. Thanks. I is the... <laughs> it's so cringe. <laughs> I know. He's one of those guys, you know? You gotta to... Oh, sorry. I'm clicking it too quickly. Come on, we better go inside. Alright, alright. I'm gonna walk like a lady. Serious lady. Look at me. 
<laughs> oh my god. Wait for me. It's rude to walk ahead of people. Standing in the garbage. No, okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'll open the door, I guess. <laughs> Give me permission to marry Eva. Oh, they click it for me. That means I have to read fast. I forbid it. You know well what would happen if you do. Those who succumb to her beauty all die in horrible ways. You don't understand. She is the one who has suffered after the deaths. She is evil. Guard, grab her. And burn her at the stake. Father. If you are sentencing her to death, then I ask you to take my life along with hers. Edward. Getting right into it. This is not part of the show. Jesus, I don't wanna. Oh my god, I, I. Go, get out of here now. <laughs> okay, hold on, let me pause. Tiger chat. As a kid in the sequel, I loved how I used to use a ton of firearms based on real life Kana parts. There's some super interesting ones like the infamous Calco M950. I don't know what that is. Oh, I didn't know that. I'm not a gun person. I don't know these things. Town Town Sheepy isn't the only one to start Halloween early. The Wendy's Fountain Drink Machine has a spooky Fanta flavor. <gasps> what does it taste like, Beastie? Is it yum? This show is lit. <laughs> ah, the opening of this game is just too effing good. It is. It gets right into it. Right into it. Also, I don't know if you noticed the girl that was sitting behind Aya, but I always felt she looked like, uh, there's this old singer that had a song about, um, what's the name of that song? Now I have to look it up. Because she looks just like her and, uh... 
And every time I see her, I think of... The song Torn by Natalie in... Um, I don't know how to say her name, her last name. But it's a very old song called, called Torn. And uh, she looks just like her. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Uh, tastes like Halloween candy. Sweet seeds. Lots of sweet seeds. Halloween candies. Hey, girl. Sorry, I have to walk. This is a serious moment. Freeze, NYPD. Hmm, you're the only one who seems to be fine. What? You should be awakening soon. What? What are you talking about? Listen, your souls are trying to communicate. They're calling out. I forgot how to fight in this game. I love it when you're evil. This is me at my most evil. I'm evil. Evil. You're evil <laughs> What's happening? My body, it's it's getting hot. Just as I thought. What is this? What did you do to me? No, 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 no. No, 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 Miss? No miss in here. bodies are communicating with each other. What? Communicating? What? What do you want? The more you use that power, the more you will become like me. Power? What power? Who are you? Eve. Eve? I'm surprised you don't know me, Aya. You should know me well. What? Right into the game. I forgot how soon it gets into this. What? What is this? What was that? <laughs> Wait, where are you going? You're, I'm not through with you yet. <laughs> I forgot how quickly it gets into things in this game. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's an old song. <laughs> Does it take you back? I as a special girl. Love it when you're evil. <laughs> with special powers. Our bodies are communicating with each other. Yo, spicy <laughs> girl on girl action. Is this a lot on Twitch? No, it's not like that. Mm. That is a powerhouse of the I don't know. Thank you for making me cozy. I keep using my analog sticks and I f keep forgetting that's not the thing here. Forgetting it's not the thing. Well, hold on. Is this other way the same thing? I forget. Look at Aya and her dress, by the way. Look at that slit! Like, damn girl! Anyway, respectfully. <laughs> respectfully, of course. Okay, yeah, it goes to the same thing. Chessy thing? Thank you. I recently got a dress just like Aya's, 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 whatever, um, 
because I want to do a cosplay of her. It's just... It's basically the same dress. I don't think the slit is as high as I is, though, unfortunately. Um, but I have to fix it because the top is too big and my boobas are too small. Hmm. Hmm. I know she's down there. Ooh. Sounds like my backup's arrived. Uh, hold on. Let's go see the backup. I will look good in a blanket. <laughs> Small booba, big booba, every size is good booba. It is. All boobas are good. It's just the dress is a little bit too big for me because I'm lamb-sized and I am tiny. And the dress is grown-up people size. Normal, quote, in quotation marks, normal people size. Um, so I have to fix it. I have to take it in. It's too big. Oh. Hi. Dead body. Nothing to say, Aya? Alright. How about this one, Aya? Nothing? Alright. Wait! I'm a cop! I'm with the NYPD! What? Hold on, I'm gonna take out my badge. Don't shoot. She put it in her boob pocket. Look how cute she is, though. Can we just admire how cute, even though she's all pixelated? She's cute, duh. Hi. Hey, why don't you have any injuries? Don't ask me. That's something I want to know. Everyone's gone burned a lot of them. Probably won't make it. Okay. Hey. I got the same gun. I got bullets if you want them. Yeah. <laughs> give me more. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me all the bullets. Thank you. Sorry, but I'm out. And I can't give you the ones in my gun. Yeah, you can, but you won't. <laughs> Hi. I wonder if that's thing called spontaneous combustion. Who knows, huh? <laughs> You think we'll be on TV? Hope this becomes a TV movie or something. Let me patch you up. Oh yeah. Okay, so you could always come outside later and uh, he'll heal you. Okay, thanks. Bye. Let's go. Also, running in those heels. I, uh... Hey, uh, I don't know. Da, I got a... Da, da. <laughs> I can't think. I have to Google later how it, you're supposed to be pronouncing her name. Is it Aya? Or Aya? I don't know. Hey, you think my date made it out okay? Do you think he's fine? Never saw him. Maybe he's dead. I almost finished my tea already. I'm a machine. Remind me of I yeah 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 yeah. Okay, now we jump down. Now we ready, cause we got all those bullets from that that cop guy. Look at this girl though. By the way, she's gonna jump in them heels, and she lands like a damn cat. Are you alone? It's dangerous here. You should go. Mmm, <laughs> this game is so good! This is a Japanese game. The pronunciation is sure meant a AI. Uh, that girl. Couldn't be. 
No, 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 we're not going up. No, no, no. I just want to see if there was anything behind me. Locked. Okay. I don't know how soon it is with me walking down this hallway. But uh, a little bit trigger warning if you don't like mice, rats, or like gory stuff. Um, there's a little cutscene that happens while walking down this ha hallway. I don't know how far it is down the hallway, but just a heads up. I think it's after these doors. After the first two doors. Is this a no? I am? Okay. Oh, is there anything in front of me? Okay, no. The atmosphere is super thick. I love it. I know! I love these games so much! Oh, I love these games so much. They're so good. Here we go. Here's the scene if you want to look away. Look away for a few seconds. And then come back. Tell you when you could look again if you if you're looking away. Okay, you could look again. You'll just see a crazy little monster thing. I'm gonna be sick. Oh god, so I'm sorry. Did you not look away? Whoa. Hi, Fuzzy. Hi, Fuzzy. <laughs> Yo, this game is old, but this game is serious, man. Jesus. Did Eve do that to the rat? What's going on here? The game is old, but the game is serious, man. I probably shouldn't be watching this on my life. <laughs> John Beastie! <laughs> oh my god, that's- that's all- that's all the yucky stuff that's gonna happen, I think. I think that's it. I think it's just that main cutscene from what I could remember as a child. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You wait there. I'm busy. <laughs> Medicine! I won't give this to that guy. He doesn't need it. Okay. Nothing over here. Okay, excuse me. Hello. You okay? You're still alive. Hold on, let me call the paramedics. M Melissa. She's... a monster. Don't try to talk now. Melissa? Melissa, you mean the main matrix? She's probably got to Suzanne too. You have to stop her. No, please wake up. Hang in there. I'm sorry, Ada. He's dead. Um, there's more explicit scenes later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Later on, but I think that's it for like the beginning-ish of the game. No pinup posters in the locker room like Metal Gear. <laughs> yeah, yo, remember Metal Gear? And I used to go in the lockers and kiss the posters, but then I couldn't do it anymore because uh. Raiden had a girlfriend. That boy is cooked. He's toasty. 
Excuse me. I'm surprised Ada walked into the room with roasted humans with no reaction. Well, she's NYPD. She's probably seen a lot of stuff already. She's seen her share of weird, disgusting things. Ah! Here, take it. Take everything. It's all on the counter. Don't scare me. I'm with the NYPD. You're the one who scared me, lady. I was just getting ready. You know, only staff were allowed in here. There was an incident here. You have to evacuate. What? You're kidding, right? Hey, I'm not dying here tonight. See ya. You will soon. He's gonna... Raiden's girlfriend is complete nut. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, don't get me started on Raiden and his girlfriend's relationship because that relationship was unhealthy on both parts. Not only the girlfriend, but also Raiden. Ooh. Yeah, he did. That clown, that clown did. He's done for. There is nothing on the counter, you liar! Check on that clown, shall we? I say the boy deserves a little kissy kissy with poster. <laughs> We're talking about Rose. Hey, Mr. Foxhound. You could say he got clowned. Whoa. He did. Yes, we're talking about Rose and Raiden's relationship because it was awful. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> I didn't want to get hit. Hi, Shifi. Hi, Fika. Hi, Shifi. Oh my god. Everyone's coming in. Hi, hi. You didn't miss too much. Missed a little bit. We were at the opera. Some actress made everyone go on fire. She said that our bodies were communicating, and then she ran away, and I'm now I'm looking for her. This is the clown that just died. It's that clown from the dressing room. He's fine. Also, oh, sorry. I didn't get a key yet, right? No, I did not. Oh, well, I mean, when AI puts you up to it, of course it is awful. <laughs> I missed everything. You missed the beginning. Yeah, the beginning's really good. I'm glad I can find catchy live again. Oh, thank you, Van. I know work takes a lot of your time. Yeah, another game that I loved back in the day. Sheepy, why are you so based? What does that mean? Is base good? <laughs> This reminds me uh, I need to be absurd. Oh. He shouldn't have been clowning around. I'm sweaty. Walking in the heat is no joke. Base is very good. Thank you. <laughs> I like these old games. This is what I grew up with. And I enjoy them very much. Thank you for the head pets. Based on what? Base, base, base. I'm good. Base means good. Um, don't mind me, sir. Medicine? Hi. Hot! Hot! Help! Help! Hmm. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, uh, you okay? What's this key? Okay. There you go. 
I'm better notify the department about what happened here. Would you like to save? You save your progress on the phone. Upstairs is like an old school Resident Evil, but it's co-op. Oh. That sounds like fun. Yeah. I love how the combat music is just relaxed, high-speed 90s vapor waves. <laughs> just fun. Like, mmm, yeah, that's my jam. I put in my soul cereal coffee and drink a good part of it. What fresh my eat? <laughs> Back kind of, but I'm in and out because of so many meetings. Hope you're waiting, sheep. Yeah, thank you, cowboy. You missed the, the rat part, so you're okay. Excuse me, sir. Mouse souls, yeah. It was a little bit gory. Uh, did I go on these? Oh, okay. Wasn't sure if they were open already. Oh, another bird. They have a lot of birds here. Nothing. Da da da. Da da da. Care package. Stretchy, stretchy! Mm, careful not to dislocate your ribs when you stretch like I do sometimes. And sit straight the and drink, drink, drink. No missing on rat up hatties. You eat that without wine. <laughs> what? Hmm. Hey, birdie. Nothing here, nothing here, nothing. Nothing? I see you. Hi. What happened, old guy? No? No? No talk to you? Okay, I guess I can't talk to you. Damn. You sure I can't talk to you? Oh, I knew I could. And I, you said something and I couldn't read it because I clicked too quickly. Um, um, oh, no! Die, dirt, birdie, birdie. Wait, get out of here. I feel so bad for the bird. <laughs> he turned into a monster! Why do I feel like there was something at this vanity and now it's it's making it like there's nothing but my childhood brain is like sheepu there was something at the vanity I guess not because that drawer keeps making me feel like there's something there I guess not Okay My little child brain sometimes has little flashbacks of these games. And it's like, remember there was a treasure here? I'm like, but I don't see it. Maybe it's this, it's this vanity, probably. Yes, okay. Ada? There we go. A diary. November 3rd, Monday. The Christmas show is set. This has been my dream. The main actress has a solo concert at the theater in Central Park. I took all that medication to get here. I have to get the lead part. I'll even sell my soul to the devil if I have to. November 17th, Monday. The cast was announced, and Suzanne and I are double cast. I want to play the part alone, but everyone knows she's good. November 21st, Friday. I think I'm overdoing it. My body is getting hotter than ever for some reason. I better take more medicine. December 6th, Saturday. I collapsed today. 
I lost consciousness after my body got hot. I don't care if I die. I just want to get through this show. December 10th, Wednesday. I passed out again. They told me to go to the doctor and get some rest. If this continues, Suzanne would definitely take my part. I need to get better. I better take a lot of medication tonight. December 11th, Thursday. Suzanne was burned in an apartment fire. Is it because I wanted the part so bad? God, please forgive me. December 17th, Wednesday. It looks like I'll be the lead. I better take more medication and work it. December 23rd, Tuesday. Opening night, everything went smoothly. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. We should have the biggest crowd of the season. And I have the solo concert the next day at the park. But I'm not feeling well. I better shape up if I want to get through this. I better take more medication. For what? Why is she taking so much? She must have a drug problem? Another key. Another key. Holy. <laughs> Deep is low. <laughs> this game gets into it so quickly. I forgot how quickly this game gets into it. To the devil? <gasps> yeah. I'm also playing old PS2 games at the moment. They're so good. Addictive personality? Mm hmm. This is why we have Retro Wednesdays. Because I love these games so much. Every Wednesday. You didn't know we play old games on Wednesday. Okay. We got another key. Hold up, I never realized this before, but was the medication actually medication? I don't remember. I guess we have to find out together as we play the game. Does someone awaken Eve? I don't know. We have to play the game. And we have to find out together. How to remember. If someone does remember, please don't spoil it. Because I would like to figure it out on my own. <laughs> Playing it again. Okay. There is three other doors. Yes. Let's go to this one first. Unfortunately, tactical RPGs don't do well live. At least I can play them on my own. See, with that... Yeah, I guess. Um, how I do it and how I see things is... Even when games don't do well... Um, for example, my Yakuza Fridays don't do very well. Um, a lot of my Retro Wednesdays don't do well as don't do well either um when we played to dino crises when we played metal gear um they don't do well but the thing is i still play them with the hopes that uh it will still it might not attract that many people but it might still attract one person that enjoys these games and I want to build a community in, on my channel full of people that like the same stuff that I like. Um, so I still play these games anyway. Even if they don't give me a big following and a big view count. Um, just because I hope in the long run it would bring in people that like the same stuff I do. And I like a lot of these games. Even if they don't get a lot of views. I like them and I enjoy them. And I'm going to play them anyway. Um, but I do understand. Sometimes. Uh, the game not doing well. People don't want to play it live. But for me. I, I, I still play them live. And I hope it gets me a following. That um, is full of people that also enjoy these games. 
No spoilers, promise. Just got hype over the small group. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're putting all the pieces together. Oh, when a raccoon joined you for Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That didn't get a lot of views. That's not necessarily true. There's an audience there. They have... They just haven't necessarily found you or anyone. Yes. There is an audience. It just might take a bit longer for them to find you and uh, for you to get that audience. But I, I, I'm still going to play them in hopes that eventually the audience would find me and we could all gush over all these old games that I also enjoy. So. Don't let it make you not want to play them live. Still play them. Even if the following isn't huge. Can I open? No? Okay. That's odd. This wall looks like it's about to crumble. You broke it! Hey, dog! Oh, damn! Are you standing, Ada? Okay. Ada, I can't really see much. So all this little spooky skeleton guy. Let's name him Jimmy. Your inventory is full. <gasps> um, whoopsie, wrong buttons. Mm, I have another gun. Is this another gun? Item increases attack power by one. Use? Okay. Okay, now I have space! See? Ooh. Now I have another thingy! No, oh, sorry. Wrong buttons. Oh, I can heal! I got magic! I forgot! I can heal myself. Um, like when I was playing Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. I mean, we're not playing Fortnite. <laughs> CP's a legend. She's already a superstar. My own Diggy. I love you. You are too, though. You're a superstar in my heart, though. I played the same trinity in a snowball until where I am today. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that, yeah! I'm inspired by the sheep. Oh, Cloudy! I have yet to take the book. Magic... Uh, yeah, I got magic powers. Why would a normal person have magic powers? What is going on? Okay. Uh, okay. Beep. Okay. Can I... Is this... Is this the chest where I could put things in? Come on. Wiggle yourself out of there. Don't drop an item. Drop an item. Okay, yes. I would like to drop my other vest up. And... I might... After I go into that other door... I might go back upstairs... There's the police! Um... Maps are going by. I'm just a Tiggy. I do Tiggy stuff. Mm. I just a sheep. I do sheep stuff. Wow, that's really loud. The police is... Do people not normally have powers? Not healy ones. You're telling me she's got a vest on over that dress? She got it on under. <laughs> that's why you can't see it. It's under her dress. She looked good though, right? Get it, Ada. The fuzz. I thought I was hearing sirens outside. <laughs> no, that was over here. I live on a, a main street, so... More ammo! The dress is the vest. It's a... Uh... <laughs> What? Hi.
Should join the button. Should join the button. anything in here. Unlock this door. Gonna go back up and have the paramedic heal me. I could just take a medicine but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna go back up and get a free heal and then go to that last door down the hall. I believe something bad happens in that door. I have a fun fact for you guys. <gasps> oh, the fun fact. I love these old games, though. We're gonna be starting another our old game soon once we finish Yakuza Kiwami Part 2, which I think we're gonna finish this Friday. And then we're gonna take a little bit of a break from Yakuza Fridays for Halloween season. And we're gonna be starting a game that came out for the GameCube called Internal Darkness Sanity's Requiem. And that's another spooky game. That I haven't played before. So I'm very excited to play that one. That's another old game. I think that came out in 2000? I think? So we're gonna be playing that one as well. For Spooky Season. Another old game. If you want to prevent fatigue with caffeine, you drink it before you're tired. Not a while. Caffeine prevents your cells from bouncing with certain chemicals that make you feel tired. Mm. I don't know. I don't drink caffeine because I have... I... Because I, I, caffeine and I have anxiety and sometimes it makes my brain and makes me not feel good. So I can't have caffeine. Eternal Darkness. Yeah! You know it, Tiggy! I'm very new to it and I'm very excited to play it. My friend Calbo recommended it because uh, they saw a little TikTok thing and, and saw that it looked very spooky and like twisted. Um, so I can't wait to play it. It's a low-crafted masterpiece. <laughs> I can't wait to play it. I played a little bit of it on Sunday just to make sure it worked. Me and Platy played a little bit of it. And um, I didn't play that far, but I, I was so into it already. It, it has a vibe, and it looks so good. I actually have a physical copy, super rare here. Oh, I can't wait to play it. I'm gonna go save if I can remember where that phone was. There was the phone where I can save. I think it's... One of these doors. Yeah, where that's on the the Halloween agenda as well. And if we end up finishing either this one or um Internal Darkness, then I might play some Silent Hill after. So, I'm going to have fun. It's my first uh my first Halloween with me actually streaming with a PC because the last Halloween I was streaming from my PS4 which made games that I was able to play very limited so I'm very happy that this Halloween I finally have my PC and I have a lot of more um a lot more options of things that I can play so I'm having a blast having a blast 
I wish I had kept anything from my childhood. Oh. Have you played Shadow of Memories? Why does that sound familiar? I don't think so. I was here for that too. Yeah, you were there for last Halloween. Yeah, and uh, it was very hard to place any spooky games. We played, uh... I forgot the name of it. Room 118 or 108, was, which was kind of a creepy game, but kind of silly. Parasite Eve, hi, Negro! I remember that ad game that you were trapped in. Yeah, Motel! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yes, that one, Cryos. I know how that feels. Not that I have a powerful laptop. My library is much bigger than ever. Yes! Power. That one, that one, yeah. Shadow of Memories is a supernatural mystery solving game. I can't really give anything else without spoiling it. Ooh, okay, I'll I'll look it up later. I love looking at new games. That I could possibly play. You birdie, stay there. I know what all the other birdies turned into and I don't trust you. Even know what that came. Ooh, I'll look it up. See, a lot of spooky games. Hi, it's Traffic. Super proud that you should be able to remember when you was like, I don't know how it's a PC. I'm just, I still don't know how the PC. I am still uh very new and very confused to a lot of it. Um. I thank Platty for all the help that he's given me. Platty's like my tech guy. So whenever I have an issue, I just <laughs> go to him and he knows he knows how to solve it. And now you're having super fun with the I am I'm having so much fun. That is called Shadow of Destiny in the US. Oh, Yes, I got IT of so many of you guys. So many of you guys are so computer, uh, schmartsy. I haven't had a, a computer since I was... Maybe... 13, 14 years old. I'm now 34. So I went a long gap without having an actual computer. So a lot of it is very new still. Oh, my buddy sleeping. My little bubba -roo. I'm walking here. It's serious. When it's serious, you have to walk. I'm Melissa. I'm... no. I'm... I am... I am Eve. Ah, I'm... I'm getting hot! Nuclear domination has finally come to an end once and for all. What? Hey, Eve. <laughs> Once again. The day for the micro... Oh, my... Oh, words are gonna be hard in this game. This game is very science-y. micro Sorry, words are hard. To be free has finally arrived. How do you words? Oh, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Mm. 
which one is more? Looks like you still need some time, girl. Until your micro kimono, whatever it's called, I don't know. Me to grow the I don't know. I don't I need to hear things. I need to hear them before I know how to say them. It's completely free. What are you saying? I don't understand you. Someone do a voice message and DM me how to say the word. <laughs> what? Where is this? Is that... Is that the little girl I saw? No, it's... My toe cold <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, Cloudy. That doctor. Wait. To be free. You okay, though? Yeah, because I healed you. Well, let me see what you guys are saying. I'm stuck in an ad trying to get me to rejoin the military. No, you can't take them. Hear that, guys? She said we smart. Uh, yeah. Baba Woo, yeah. So Baba Woo is sleeping. I'm walking Eve. Eve, yeah. You're not Eve, you're sheepy. I know, but the other, the other lady, her name is Eve. I guess she made that deal with the devil. <laughs> she did. <laughs> she did. She made that deal with the devil, man. Eve's design is so amazing. She's beautiful and terrifying at the same time. Yes. Says some cool dresses. Yes. Also, it's a real-time RPG. I guess. I don't know. I guess. You would know more than me. I don't know words. I don't know what things mean. You mean powerhouse. This music is tight, though. I was watching anime yesterday and the main character was showing off his muscles and then a background character said he's so big. I bet he has to pay property tax. <laughs> Very big for a bit. Take your time, take your time, take your time. Mm, hold on. Okay. Get chat up. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Should I go save again? I'm gonna go save again. Excuse me. It's just the room right next door. This one. Birdie? Stay there. Don't you come for me. Phone? Phone? Oh, um, there you go. It's like you have to hit the most perfect part. A little spot for it to work. I'm going to say, never trust all those safe, but Parasite Eve is older than all those safe. Yeah. We don't have all those safe here. It's not that. It, it, this is 1998. 1998. Old, old. Okay, let's go. Another hole. Eve likes to make holes. Jumping now on another hole. Mm. 
Again, landing somehow on my feet. I can't go up this time, so I am now stuck down here. Ugh. Hi, Red Dolls. some kind of special tax force or is she just a lady with magic she's part of the NYPD why does she have magic we don't know yet parasite powers have involved scan analyze the enemy's HP and weaknesses we have parasite powers why I don't know I've always heard good things about Parasite E, but I never looked into it. Oh no, so there is right there. Yeah, the rats are scary. Apparently, she has pop magic powers because you're playing as her. <gasps> also, she has healing powers and now scan powers. Why does she have these things? We don't know. For the gun reason, Cryo, so she's NYPD, so she's like Jill, which means that you love her already. Mm. Oh, hi. I forgot about you, froggies. No! Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Keep touching them by accident. Because I'm getting too close. And even touching them makes you get her ouchies. Hmm. <sighs> so that's why she's walking in. <laughs> magical girl, she be. Can we get a magical girl out for one day? Yeah. For she be. I just don't love every super cop. No. Just... just Jill and Aya now. I like RPGs where they let you dodge attacks. Yeah! Do I hear a little girl coughing? Wait, listen. Did you hear it? Like, every once in a while you hear her. Like, it goes... Huh, like a... like a gasp or something. And it sounds like the little girl from earlier. Ooh, new gun! New gun! I don't know anything about guns, so I don't know if this is any better than what we have. Oh, it is better than what we have. Can we still use the same bullets that we were using for the other gun for this gun? Right? I hope so. You hear her, right? I'm not going crazy, right? You hear the little kid. Only if ever she evil sheep will get an anti-magical girl outfit. <laughs> I I don't know if everyone was here when I said it before, but um I plan on getting a proper PNG sometime mid-September, late September. Me and my artist are gonna finally be working on a uh, actual PNG with expressions so I'm very excited for that and once that is done like regular sheepy PNG I do plan on getting an evil sheepy PNG definitely definitely there will be an evil sheep one I know nothing about magical girls magical cowboys however Ooh. you hear her right Kryos it's a little girl She's gasping. Ugh. I can't fight up here. There's no space. 
Oh. Okay, I could still use the same bullets. That's nice. Ooh. Wasn't sure if they were gonna be different. But Ooh, vibes. That's nice. Is that for when I die? Let me check. Can I check? Oh, wrong button. Is there the revives for when I die? Restores life when you die. Yay! Wait, look at my bonus points. Do you see it? On the right side? It says bonus points? <laughs> little girl. The you're going to die down here, girl. The little girl that we, we saw when we jumped down here the first time and she was coughing. I don't know if you were here during that part, but when we jumped down the first time in that other area, there was a little girl, and uh, she was the same little girl from our flashbacks, and she was coughing. And you can hear her gasping in the background. Funny number. Yeah. There she is, see? She's crying. You're the little girl I saw at the theater. Are you lost? Wait, little girl, don't go. There's a tress there's a chest thing back here though. How do I go? How do I go back here? There you go. Nothing to say about this? Okay. Oh, there's another one back here. There you go. Ooh! Another gun thing! Keep pressing circle. I guess because of metal gear. Increase attack power by one. Mm, this one. There you go. Let's go follow the little girl, yeah? Happens here. I remember my little child brain remembers this is the boss area. My little child brain remembers. Oh no, not not yet, but soon. There's a there's a boss area coming soon. My little baby brain remembers. It was a big alligator thing. of my mecha after you? Of course! Show me a picture later! I wanna see! There's a switch and emergency phone. Use the phone. Yes. I was thinking if I should heal before I use the phone because I know that little alligator thing is coming soon. And I'm scared. And I want to be fully healed for it. I want to be fully healed for when that happens. Oh, it took a lot of my PE. My Parasite Eve. Okay.
Eve. Walking again, because I'm serious. I mean business. Oh, they're right there. My body. My body's getting hot again. <laughs> I is ready to take me on just by herself. Well, even if you did have more people with you, they'll just burn, right? Everyone else but you. You are. Tell me, Eve, why? Why me? Why am I the only one? You'll find out eventually. Even if you don't understand, don't worry. Your microgomomabababas will. They're always known. I'm gonna give you some time. Some time to think and some time to evolve. And the day shall arrive when you will awaken. So good, it's so good. So Here's the boss battle I remembered as a child. Let's go. There are two targets. Thanks, game. What? Oh. He runs at you! Oh. to dodge him and I remember not like fighting this guy because he sucks.
Mind me, little guy. Big guy. Ooh. I remember hating fighting him as a kid because he sucked. Parsley would have been an amazing high school class. <laughs> what? Those are some gross sound effects. Oh, when she turned off Squishy? That messed up, so... I will give you some time to evolve, fight this crocodile in the meantime that I also kind of made with my goo body parts. Oh my gosh, these classic sound effects. <laughs> Parasite powers have evolved. Slow. Slows enemies at recharge. We also have a vest now. A new vest. Hmm. When I will evolve, will when I will awaken. Just tell me what you want, Eve. Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. No, tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Wanna, 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 wanna really, really, really wanna take a God. We live in front- we're live in front of the Cromerty Hall, which has become a scene of complete chaos. Miss, you're the sole survivor of this horrible ordeal, correct? I... Until now, this combustion theory has been unknowledged only by Arcro Analyst. Please, just leave me alone. This incident happened to take place on Christmas Eve of all nights. I would like to represent the citizens of the city and interview exclusively. <laughs> Are you crazy, Jim? Did you get this on tape? Scam, scram, buddy. Daniel. Sorry, I'm late, Aya. Hey, boss. Aya, you okay? That was really something that happened back there. Yes. Oh, but my date. Heard from a cop that your boyfriend ran out of there like a wuss. <laughs> Uh, sorry about your date didn't go well. <laughs> it's not like that. I had him escort me because he kept pestering me for a date. Yeah, but of all places, the opera? Well, that's a story. Ha! <laughs> so why the opera, huh? Is that the in thing right now? Saw that ad in the paper. I don't know. Just caught my eye. Don't tell me you were on this case. <laughs> so you finally got some cop instinct in you, huh? Instinct? Daniel, shouldn't you be with your son? It's Christmas Eve. He knows his dad's a cop. My boy understands. Anyway, to change the subject. I heard things from people who were there. But this one is one hell of an incident, huh? Hmm. Micro blah, 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 blah. And I was in the hospital. Hey, Aya, you asleep? Oh well. Don't blame you after what you've been through tonight. Papa! I knew I felt your nose on my lake. Is that a Baba Rusha? I'll be chatting in a moment. I just need a, a place where I can pause the game. Hi, Stinky. It all started with this incident. Six days that were to become a nightmare for all. People will eventually forget and go on with their lives. But I would never forget it. It was pure terror, but... 
It was also six days filled with familiar memories. Day two, fusion. Okay, I could read chat now. Mm -hmm. Hi, Charlie. Good old parasite Eve. This guy looks like a clown or boy. <laughs> yes, that's why he got punched in the face. Whoop. <laughs> in the back of the head, the powerhouse of the cell. Mm hmm. Hair package stretches. <laughs> And the traces. And take a drink. Okay. Save your progress. Yes, please. I forgot that this game takes place in six days. All of this happens to Aya in six days. Hey, you okay? You ought to be resting. I wish I could, but I'm the only one who knows what happened last night. Look at our casual outfit. Look how cute. Been gathering some info on Melissa. She's got no relatives. And no close friends. She was sick often, always on some kind of medication. The people at the opera said they were amazed she could even stand on stage. Her apartment burned down right after the incident, so we have no info on her medication. So what's the spontaneous compression stuff all about? It wasn't exactly spontaneous. People were actually set on fire. Oh, come on. What, like one of those ESP things? That's the best way to describe it for now. ESP, huh? Well, I'm not buying it. But if you were right, how are we supposed to deal with something like that? I believe her. After all, I was the only witness so far. But if we're gonna take on a suspect like that, we better ask Baker for a better sidearm. Hmm. I read your report. Still hard to believe, but we can't deny all those deaths. We're gonna go all out to solve this case. Make sure you're well equipped. Go down to the weapons department and give your permit to Torres. He'll help you out. My permit. Thanks. Anything else you have to say? Top boss guy. Can I use your phone to save again? Come back later. All right. Look at our cash outfit. We got some. We got some blue denim jeans. We got a little white top. We could probably t-shirt top, and then we have. I guess this is supposed to be maybe a leather jacket or maybe a black denim crop jacket. And we got some blue black sneakers. We're cutie. Look at our butts. Okay. Bye, boss. I'm going to talk to Torres. We might be up against psychic powers. Well, here's a larger gun. Good luck. Look at those legs. There's a lot of legs happening. I know, she a tall lady. <laughs> but if you're right... How are we supposed to deal with something like that? I don't know. Hey, Daniel. I believe her. Okay. Just get a bigger gun. Oh, there's a phone in here. No, I don't need a safe. I like to look in garbage cans and everything. There's always something in the garbage. Always something in the garbage. There's nothing in the garbage. Uh, there we go. There's a 
cozy. It's so cozy. It's hard to click things because you have to press it in the most perfect spot for it to work. Oh, another vest. There was a, one that they gave me, right? Okay, no. Not good enough. They make my critical go down. Well, this one doesn't make it go down too much. We put this one on, maybe? Yeah. Any more lockers? Medicine. I used all my medicine, so I need more. Up, guys. I, uh, you better put on your vest too. Can't be too careful. I got it on. I just put it on. <laughs> At last, it's mine. What? What's yours? Critical is critical after all. Yeah. It just went down a few points. Everything else went up though. Really good. Weapons department. You didn't hit your head last night, did you? It's right downstairs. Thanks. I'm gonna go here first, then. Upstairs is the exit, as it says. And I believe that other door is an exit as well. Go down this way first. Oh. Authorized personnel only. Weapons department. to just watch them. I always come here after my shift to relax. Oh, that's nice. Look at the wolf eyes. That paper looks like it's something. That's the only thing I don't like about these old games is sometimes they make things look like they're clickable and then they're not clickable. Look at those puppers. I forgot to... Only other things I know about this game is the music is good. I forgot a lot about this game as well. I haven't played it since I was nine, so I think I remember a little bit of this part and then I think a little bit of the, the next part. Um, I believe she goes to like a outside area. But I don't remember very much from it. So it's a little bit of a new game for me as well. So I don't remember too much. Hey. Hey, Taurus. Are you Taurus? Hold on. I got a tool. Hold on. Hold on, guy, okay? What 
What's in this box? Like, take it before you're talking to me? Probably not. Hey. Oh, you're Wayne. Hey, they're good looking. What the crap, Wayne? Where's Torres? That baldy? Who knows? So will it be? Shotgun. Rocket launcher. Wayne. Yes, sir. Doesn't look like he's bald. Idiots like you are the reason why guns won't disappear from this country. Get your ass back to weapon storage. You're far from ready to be handling guns in here. Okay, okay, sheesh. Hey, Taurus. Taurus, I need some equipment. For last night's case, I heard it was quite a mess. But as long as cops rely on guns, criminals will too. It's a vicious cycle. I hate to hand a weapon to a young cop like you. But I heard, but I hear this isn't your ordinary crook. Guess I can't send you off empty-handed. Say, you can't carry any more equipment. Wait, take some of her things and put them in storage. Hey, yeah, yeah. You got something to say, officer? No, sir. So you want to leave something here? Leave equipment. Um, the heal. I don't need these anymore because I have the one that is the best one on my body. Do I need a club? I want to say no, but I'm scared to take it off my person. Because I'm scared I'll run out of bullets. And then I'll be like, oh no, silly sheep, why did you get rid of your club? So for now, I'm going to hold on to it. But eventually, when I become more comfortable with this game, I might just get rid of it. <laughs> I like the little FPS flap animation. <laughs> It's a good game. It's a good game. Um, and then probably get rid of this gun as well. Because I have the other one on me. Okay. There you go. You know, I gotta organize things. Thanks, Wayne. Here, this is the most powerful gun I can allow you to have. A M16A1? Attack 35, range 112, bullets 16. I don't know what any of this means because I'm not a gun person. But you people that probably know more knowledge know if this is a... It's probably like a machine gun, I'm guessing. Captain Baker already notified me. Show me your modification permit again. Yes, you got it. Which gun? Oh. Oh, we're modifying something? Hmm. I guess we modified this one. Bullet sixteen means you have it has sixteen bullets. <laughs> sixteen bullets in the the before you have to reload. Hence M sixteen. Ah, I see. Um. Oh, it says rifle on the top. Okay, it's a rifle. This is a handgun. I'm learning things. <laughs> I would assume it has a mag size of 16 shots. Yes, okay, okay, okay. It says on the top it's a rifle. I don't know what that means either. I don't know what a rifle is. Anyway. um, Should I just mod this one then? I guess. Add slot. What does that mean? 
I don't know what I'm doing. What does a slot mean? It a gun. A go bang bang. I don't know what the range means in terms of game though. Seems like it's got modification slots. Yes, I, d I just don't know which one to put it on. I don't know if I should put it on the new gun. Or maybe I guess I put it on the new gun. Oh, but uh, maybe I could just make my uh, my handgun more powerful. I don't know. Any, mini, miny, mo, catch a tiger, bite a toe. If he hollers, let him go. Any, mini, miny, mo. Do you have to add a slot now? I think so. Hmm. Uh, that's slot. Okay. All right, just wait here. All set. But just remember, cops own guns for protection. Don't let the guns own you. Thank you, Taurus. Psst. Don't tell Taurus, but you can use your tool to tune up your guns. You could rearrange equipment parameters and add effects to tweak your equipment. I can show you some cool tune-up techniques. Thanks, Wayne. Whoa. Tune up icon. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me reach it. And before Apple gets a mini gun, mini guns are in fact large. Oh, tune up icon. Use tool item. You can add or remove parameters and add effects to, on your weapon or armor to create your customized equipment. If you remove an added effect from a weapon or armor, that equipment will disappear. The number of added effects that can be added to a piece of equipment is determined by the number of slots on that equipment. Okay, okay, that's where the slot came in from earlier. You can increase the number of slots by getting your equipment modified at the NYPD weapons department. Okay. I got a P. You got it? Trust me, you can never have too much fiber or power. Of course, can't use them without bullets, so you better make sure you always have your club. Just in case, you know, I know I was telling chat that, that I'm kind of scared of getting rid of my club just in case I run out of bullets, you know? No, why don't we just leave that stuff you don't need with me? Mm, store equipment, store item, discard junk. Discard junk? What are you talking about? You got no junk with you right now, okay? Uh, do I have any items I could give you? Can you take my keys that I probably don't need anymore? Take those keys. And we're gonna move these. Okay. All nice and ready to go. There you go. Nice. Okay, that's all. Thank you, Wayne. I see Tories and Wayne have the classic bad cop, cool cop dynamic. <laughs> nice gift, otherworldly monsters, the nice stick. We whap them. We buck them. We do it. I'm gonna take a little bit break though. I'm gonna give Papa a early lunches and I'm gonna also pee because I've finished most of my tea and I have a full bladder. So I'm gonna be right back. 
I hope you guys are enjoying the game so far. I'm really enjoying it. I can't wait to play more of it. And and it's really nice to, to have you guys company. So I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go pee. I'm going to get Bubba his snackers. Right, Bubba? Oh, I want to snuggle them so bright and squish his little cute face. Anyway, I'm going to be right back. Papa has his snackles. I have empty bladder to drink more hydrates. Okay. Hey, what's in the box? Oh. Okay. Can I get behind a counter? No. All right. Thanks, Torres. Thanks, Wayne. 
guys are very helpful. Look at me. Look at me! <laughs> Hold on. I wanna see this tuna thing. Plus three, plus one. I don't know what that means. Oh, well. I never mess with stuff like that because I never understand. Excuse me? Hello? Hey! Hey there, you lost? Uh... Ben! Daddy! So this is Ben. Ben, this is Aya. Now, what are you doing here? Here! Tickets. Oh yeah, the concert. Sorry, son. Daddy's really busy today. I promise I'll make it up for it. Fine! Ben! Ben, where's your mommy? Guess every kid needs a mother- Oh. Hi, cryos. <laughs> That's not true. I was raised by my father too after my mother died. I always be grateful for him. Yeah. Well, his mother's still alive. Oh, just neglectful. Do I gotta go see my boss guy? Now that I got my gun, he was the one who told me to go get the gun. Do I have to go back there? <laughs> Cryos. Not boss guy, chief. Yes, the side chief. Is Daniel my boss guy? And this guy's my chief guy? Sir? You were looking for me? Yes. We're having a press conference now, and I want you there too. Me? That's right. You'll be on national television as the sole survivor of that incident. I see. But you only answer when I ask you. The media is looking for anything to grow about us. They may even turn into a suspect. You will let me do the talking, understood? Yes, sir. Okay, then. Let's go to the press. Chief boss guy. I see, I see. I see, I see. I just call everyone boss. So you were saying this could be a work of a terrorist? That is what we currently separate. How about accounts of officers and firemen at the scene busting into flames? That was... That was due to rare, highly flammable chemical which was used to start the fire. Another question. How did Detective Bria survive without so much as a minor burn? That's a result of her quick thinking and training as an officer. I'm asking her the question. She... She said that my microchromomas blah blah were a mutation. I uh... You're what? Who said this? Melissa. No. She says she was Eve? But according to a report, Melissa Pierce was killed in the fire. Melissa did not die. Her body has been taken over by this... Eve. 
What's this Eve? Some kind of an alien? People, please. She is very tired. And we still are investigating. That will be all for today. She was too good. I, uh, I thought I told you not to say anything. Telling the truth, sir. That is not the point. Who's going to believe you? You're the only... You only stir up the media and cause people to panic. Sir, she was only... Baker here. Who? What does he want? Well, put him through then. This is Captain Baker. What? Meat? You have to speak up. Yes. What? Yes, all right. Some Japanese scientists, I think. Couldn't understand his English too well. He was raving about some micro something. Says he's coming over here. Mido? It's Mido Grimola blah 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 blah. You mean the thing in the cell that makes energy into oxygen? Energy from oxygen, sorry. May have heard about that in school. That's what Eve had said. But it's time for it to be set free. Hey, I just read that some researcher at the museum wrote a new theory on them. Sir, taking Aya to go talk to this researcher. Go. Better get there before the media. He may explain that phone call too. Yes, sir. Come on, Aya. It was a bad idea to have you in that interview. I'm sorry. I am not gonna lie here. I am telling my truth. Hold on, Daniel. I'm gonna save. Okay, Daniel, you gonna drive me? I can't drive. I don't have a license. I'll bring the car around. Meet me at the front. Yeah. I'm going. I'll meet you there first. to have on Christmas, huh? Yeah, you got you can say that again, sir. Hold on, I wanna see where the stairs lead then. Because that also says an exit. And I just wanna see. Authorized personnel allowed to pass here. Okay. Thanks. Hi. Let's go. Let's go see that scientist guy. Yeah, 
left already, Bubba. That was quick. We're going to the Museum of Natural History. Dr. Hans Kalp will be there. Dr. Kalp? What's this air what's his area of research? Well, according to the papers, he's working on a new theory. Micromanola or something. Well, this seems to cover the whole genetics spectrum. Sorry, where's the heart? That's odd. To have a PhD and be working in a museum. Well, he's pretty antisocial and doesn't like to waste time outside research. Oh, great. We're gonna have a grand time with this one. Yeah, yeah, I know where you're going with this. Just be careful this time, huh? Are you referring to the press conference? Yeah. Daniel, why do you kiss the chief's butt? You two joined the force at the same time, didn't you? Yeah. But that was years ago. Now he's my boss. Yeah, cloudy that music! The museum? It's the sheepy police. Yeah. Haven't been in forever. Let's go to the museum. American Museum of Natural History. Haven't been to the museum in forever either. Probably think I've gone once in my life. It's been a while since I visited the museum. Mmm. The world of dinosaurs. Dinosaur exhibit. Loved these things when I was a kid. Hmm. Looks like it's closed today. Yeah, because it's a holiday. Hey, wait! Well, let's see what the security guard ha can do for us. Da -da -da! Da -da -da! Dinosaurs! I'll stretch this. I'll put my quick homo something in the TTS, but it's funnier if you don't know. <laughs> I might Google it later. And have Google pronounce it for me. Thank you for the care package, Demon Fox King. Thank you for taking care of my body. I want to go see the dinos. Oh, don't you love? Okay, for the people who actually have seasons. So Cryos might not even know this. Don't you love the sound of snow crunching under your feet? Oh, it's 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 as good as in the fall when you walk through a pile of crunchy leaves. <gasps> doo -doo. Who did the tootsies? Who did the tootsies? There was tootsies. Patty. Patty. Thank you so much for the donation for the Ellis Dello Society. Everybody did a dinosaur. Oh, thank you so much. Well, something was crunching already. It wasn't the snow. <laughs> it was our bones. But also, this the sound effect is so good. Everyone doing a dinosaur. Hmm. I love it. Okay. You know? Okay. It was indeed, it was my bones. Mine's too, but the crunchy snow sound. Hey there, how you doing? Doing okay, pretty cold day though, how about yourself? Well, off the NYPD, we're looking for Dr. Clap. He works here, doesn't he? Sure does, as a matter of fact, he's up there in his room right now. Did he do something? Nah, we just want to talk to him, that's all. Thank you. It shouldn't take long. Both legs, in fact. <laughs> cryos. My sweet cryos. Place is pretty creepy without any people. You'll find him in the research lab on the second floor. Thanks. What's your name, sir? He's been pretty busy for the past few weeks. Doesn't come out ever. Thanks. I want to go see the dinos, Daniel. Oh, by the way, could you sign in? It's policy. Let's just keep track of who comes in. Thanks, Aya. 
Gee, Daniel, you sure don't want to run down here and do it yourself? Notebook's on the counter. Thanks. Yeah. For the save again. Is this a phone I can save at? Yes. Don't leave me alone in the museum, I'll just sing. What do you mean? Is that a reference to something? Just my name? Yep, that should be enough, unless you want to leave your number too. <laughs> Anything else? Daniel! But I want to go see the dinos, Daniel! Not gonna let me go see the... Look, there's a dino exhibit! Do not answer. Ooh. No, it's just because it will be empty and they... Oh, I want to hear cry or sing! It makes me happy! It makes me happy. It makes me happy. Hey, sir, what's your name? I'm about to head on out of here. Hope you two get the information you need. Thanks, sir. Hey, Aya. Over here. No. You can't tell me what to do. I'm gonna look over here first. <laughs> Let me in! Let me in! <gasps> Dino! Which one is this? Eh. Which one is this? It doesn't tell me. Oh. Eh, I'm coming. Hey, it's open. Let's check it out. Alright, you're not gonna knock first, Daniel? I guess not. You're a cop. You do whatever you please. Excuse me. Hello, hey. Dr. Clap? Dr. Clap. I hear you. We're with the NYPD. Would we'll like to ask you a few questions? Professor, we're looking for clues concerning the incident that occurred. Are you excusing me? Again, what is this? This man. I know him. I think. What's wrong? You okay, Aya? Yeah. Would like to ask you about the microcomalolas research you've been doing? NYPD, huh? Why are you interested in my work? The suspect mentioned that the microcomalolas would be set free? Now do you? That suspect ignited people without laying a finger on them. Then it transformed into some kind of creature and ran off. Since she mentioned the microcomalolas... We were hoping you could supply us with some info. <laughs> you two have absolutely no idea what the true Megalomomos is like. Do you? They possess its own unique genetic code. Its own? Are you saying it's a separate organism? Precisely. Kind of like a parasite or something, huh? Parasite? It's an interesting way of describing this most fascinating creature. We cannot live without the Microbomos. Do you understand? They create energy for us. Without it, we're nothing. We are here because of them. They allow us to be here. Our brain, for example. The brain functions due to the interactions between ac ac aeons and d. Whoa, words are gonna get hard now. Because this is things I know nothing about. 
their interaction is possible due to the energy the Mango Momos provides. Did you know that they are capable of discharging whoa, 200,000 V of electricity? This is not only pertains to electrical discharge, but also applies to heat energy as well. Oh, that's why they kept saying that they were hot every time that they were gonna change. The bird said it, and then uh, Eve kept saying it as well. And Aya kept saying she felt hot. Heat. Then the compunctions from last night were... For a human to burn and melt, 600, six, 1600 degrees of heat must be generated. There are several hundred megalomomos present within a single cell. If all of them in the body begin functioning at the same time, a tremendous amount of energy would be generated and released. Melting a human into a puddle of fluid would be a simple task with so much energy. So you're saying that they ignite these people? Professor, you may be right in that we need the Momoas to live. But in the end, we're just using them for energy, right? <laughs> you have no idea. They control over all egg, um, organisms' growth. Take this hand, for example. Before we're born, the hand is merely a glob of flesh. But when cells between the fingers degenerate, that's when the fingers first form. Sorry. When the cells which make up the body aren't needed anymore, it re receives a signal to die. The signal is ignited by the mabobobos. <laughs> when it is relied, relayed, the uh, genetic information in the nucleus is cut off and in essence dies. The same can be said for aging. The well mutates 10 times faster than cells. Of course, this only applies to mutant, mutated forms of Magamomolos as well. When too many mutant normal person she be what the heck i'll google it after street wait no let me google it now then let me google it now i'm gonna google it and see how you pronounce how do you say I have my stream open. Okay. Mitochondrion. 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 Even that is hard to say. Okay. It's a Mitochondrion. No. Myocro. Mitochondrion. Mitochondria. <laughs> It's hard. When the micros, we'll just say that. When too many micro uh, multiply, energy production level decreases. The decrease in energy production is associated with aging process. So, are you still stupid enough to say that we are the higher species? But you're not saying that the micros is doing all this concentratedly, right? Pronunciation. I know, but my pronunciation is still so hard. I can't pronounce words. So even hearing it, I, I did the pronunciation on Google and I still can't even say it correctly. I like to blame that I was mute for a year and that made my pronunciation worse. And I also like to blame that English is hard and I would like to also blame that I also have tongue tied, which makes my tongue a lot shorter. Um, so it makes pronouncing things hard. So that's that's my excuses. It's okay, she but what well, was well, perfectly acceptable answer to yes, we are we are still gonna giggle at you though. <laughs> she be it pronounced mitochondria. 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 
When I said that the micro on micro John Microtochondria. I am gonna forget it every time. I'm gonna forget it every time. I'm gonna have to look at the, the pronunciation every time to get it. Micro mitochondria. Oh god. <laughs> Commutate ten times faster than normal cells. I'll just say micro micro blah 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 blah. I also meant that they could evolve at a rate ten times faster. Since the beginning cre of creation, the mitochondria has been evolving at this rate. It's no surprise if they progress a power beyond their conscience. No um, surprise at all. Okay, let me tell you something. There was a scientist who tried to determine the mutation rate of the mitochondria. With this, the scientists wanted to establish a connection with human ancestry. Blah, blah, blah. Ancestry. Oh, so see, now all words are getting hard. Once one word gets hard, all of them get hard. <laughs> I should cheap, cheap, cheap. See, all the words are getting hard now. The tongue tie is really working now. I should teach Sheepy Finnish. It would be hilarious. I wanted to do a uh, stream where people try to teach me languages because it's gonna be so hard for me. Sheepy did it. She did it. It's okay. You pronounce it big perfectly. <laughs> In 1987, it was announced that the root of all humans could be traced to a single woman in Africa. This finding was announced around the world. And with this, the mitochondrial theory spread like wildfire. You know what they called the root of it all? Mitochondria Eve. Oh, Eve. Mmm, splendid name. Just incredible. Eve. The suspect in yesterday's case called herself Eve. What? Hey, if you know anything, you better not be holding back on us. She called herself Eve. Sorry, but I told you what I know. I'd like to return to my studies now. I believe you know the way out. Hey, you better explain what the hell is going on here. Type a type a type a type. I'm busy. Daniel, forget it. Let's just go. God damn it. Hmm. Doc knows something. He's not talking, but he knows something. He knows something. What the hell's wrong with that guy? I can't stand him. That man... I've seen him before. But I can't remember where. It's Daniel. What? Okay, we'll be right there. Aya, uh, looks like we got a break in the case. What? We gotta get back to the station. Aya, uh, hang on. I'm kicking this into turbo. Wear your seatbelt! I got the poof, but I'll have a wonderful stream. Bye bye. Bye, Tiggy! See you later. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye bye. New York City, Police Department, 17th Precinct. Wait, Daniel. Wait for me. Yeah. I'm gonna say first, Daniel. I don't know what you're gonna make me do. I'll follow you in a second. I'm gonna use this phone. I'm gonna save. Mm 
I say this might be a unpopular opinion? And maybe it's because I've seen Resident Evil games way too often. But I'm kind of liking this better than Resident Evil. Though I don't think they should be compared, really, because they're totally two different things. They just came out around the same time. But I just feel like the story for this is just happening so quickly. And I like it. Let's go, folks. Oh, oh, we have a meeting, Daniel? That's what it is? Let's go, folks. We're starting the meeting. Okay. I'm going. Daniel, you're... You're tall. <laughs> Look at our height difference. <laughs> you're tall, Daniel. Okay, bye. See you in there. Are they gonna scold me for talking? Melissa's solo concert was scheduled for today. She had disappeared after last night's incident and the concert was cancelled. But people were still gathering at the stage. We must not let another massacre happen again. Okay. The concert as the, is at the Central Park Amphitheater. Central Park. What is it, Daniel? Ben and Lorraine. Lorraine? Lorraine. They're at that concert. What? Daniel. Screw you, Baker. My son's in danger. Daniel. Aya. Watch his back. Yes, sir. I got another mod permit. Let's go put it on our other gun. I put it on the, the rifle. One of the mod permits on the rifle. So maybe we should put the other one. I'll be with you in a moment, Daniel. <laughs> maybe we should put the other one on the handgun. So they both can have one, you know? Let's go see Torres. When are you gonna let me tune up the guns? I didn't ask to be assigned here to watch over the warehouse all day, you know. As long as you see guns as toys, you'll never touch them. Hey, I know I can make a stronger gun than you. Guns aren't supposed to be stronger, you numbskull. They're supposed to be safer. Fine, you geezer. <laughs> These two? <laughs> Hope I didn't interrupt anything, you two. Hey, Torres. I have another permit. Sorry, Aya. Didn't mean to make a scene. But that goes for you, too. You can never be too careful with a gun. Do you have a, a equipment modification permit with you? I do. I have this one. Which gun? Um, I did it on my other one earlier, so I would like to have it on this one now. I think. Wait, which one is this? Yeah, my handgun. I would like to have it on my handgun now. All right, just wait here. Thank you. They kind of have the same hairstyle. <laughs> he has his in a ponytail, and I think uh, Wayne does it. All set. Just remember, cops own guns for protection. Don't let the guns own you. Thank you. Hey, Wayne. You all right? Man, I could do so much better. I could turn that gun into a canyon. Easy. Wanna leave me something here? Nah, I don't got anything. I still have the same stuff I had earlier. Um. Blah, blah, blah. Can I move things and make this more organized? You know how I am. I like to make things so organized. Why? I don't know. I just do. It's my organizing thing in me, you know? Just want to organize things. 
I want to make them all look pretty and in order. Oh, moving everything. Making them look nice and in order. See? Nice! Lots of get done now. I like the Final Fantasy hand icon and the generic um, RPG potion medicine icon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's cool. Looking good, looking good. Everything looking good. Okay, see you guys. I gotta go with Daniel. I'm gonna go save again. So I don't have to do that whole bit again. Just in case. I like the, the little... When you save, it goes from off to on. It's very uh, satisfying to watch. I like it. Okay, I believe Daniel went out this way. Does Melissa or oh no E walk from us? Oh, looks like she wants to gather people in one big area. Damn, that thing's got my boy involved. She's gonna pay for this. Let's hurry. Just hang in there, Ben. Oh, just hang in there, Ben. I'm coming for you. Guess you driving? Yeah, it's Daniel. He driving fast. He is in a hurry. He, his son is there. Central Park. Do you think we'll see Metal Gear? Bean. B E N. <laughs> ben. Ben. Bean. <laughs> Daniel, stop! I gotta get my boy, rookie. Whatever. Whatever. Whoa! Whoa, he got on fire. Careful. Sometimes you gotta look before you leap, old timer. I don't care if I burn. I'll go. Ben's my son. He's the only family I got. Damn it. I can't do anything. Leave it to me. Why don't Whoa. you do it? <laughs> Why don't you do it? <laughs> but, but... I'll get them out safe, I promise. Besides, Ben needs you. You won't do him any good if you're dead. Alright. I'm counting on you, Ayo. I know. Alright. Hmm. Looks like Metro City from Final F Final Fight, and though they're all based on New York. Bean, <laughs> where are you? Can't you see the visible fire particles, officer? Okay, I'm done. <laughs> you got any bullets to give me? Benz, don't worry, I'll find him. I won't come back until I do. Can I leave? Bye. 
Oh, wait. Can I actually? Oh no, come back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm going back. <laughs> I just said bye. Okay, I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Oh! I just left for a second! What the heck? He's dead. What? They went up in flames. What's going on in there? I don't know. I left for like a second. Harry rushed in without listening to Daniel and... <gasps> One of our friends died. Our friend died. Because remember there was two other random guys. I'll save your bean officer. Walks in that direction. Oh. <laughs> I guess it's good to cut thing. I don't know. Literally five seconds and someone ran in. Yeah. Okay, we got a phone. We got a phone. Give me. Let me save up. Anything in here? No. There's a chest. You see the chest? I do. Okay. That's cool. Having a walk in Central Park. That must be nice. Snakey snakes. No, 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 no! I'm poisoned! Why are the snakes so powerful? Doesn't cure my poison though. It doesn't kill my poison though. Am I still poisoned? No? Are you okay? Imagine you leave for a minute and there's a huge stack of bodies there. <laughs> what kind of snake can take multiple gunshots? <laughs> Sorry, sneaky snakes. Guess there's snakes in the park. Guess that's a normal thing. A battle snake. RPG snakes are always hella powerful. The solid kind. You're right! The solid snakes. They can always take multiple. The Central Park Zoo! Oh, I could actually go in. I didn't know I could go in. <laughs> Hold on. I thought there was gonna just be nothing. I thought I was gonna go over here and there was gonna be a thing. Okay, I guess we're going to the zoo. These are a lot of dates, you know? We went to the opera, we went to the museum, we went to the park, we're going to the zoo. M9. Oh, it's lower than my other one. It's lower than my handgun. That's not cool. It has more bullets though. 
A solid snake could take a missile and eat a ration and be fine. Romantic game. Date with Aya and Chad? <laughs> Yay! I like they dance. Can I wear a cute outfit to the date? I would like to wear a cute outfit. Oh, never mind. Birdies. Oh, can't move that far. That's not nice, game. Giving me this little small area to run in. Junk. I don't want junk. Giving me junk. Let's try out this other gun. See if we like this. Where's the Parasite Eve visual novel dating sim? <laughs> the battle music is good, huh? I forgot how good the music in this game was. Oh. <gasps> well, wait, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> now we're gonna come back and there's gonna be another person that. There's gonna be two people now, so the one. Oh, thank goodness. Ring, ring. Sir, or ma'am, or they. Oh, <gasps> a vest. Ooh, new vest. Okay, hello. Eve was here. Yeah. Are these things like I'll go into? No. Don't make me run at it, Aya. What is this? and handgun. Oh, okay, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't think it was another area. Oh. Oh. Tool, another one. Oh yeah, oh, I didn't look at this door. Crunchy, crunchy. to get into the, the birdie cage. Ooh. 
almost died. <laughs> yeah. These games, man, they're good. I don't know why people don't play them more often. Was there anything else down here? In this area? Peach says hi. Hi, Wendy. Hi, Peach. I just saw your wife earlier, Whimsy. Tiggy was here. And then Tiggy left. Uh, there's too many areas for me to go and I'm confused. <laughs> there's too many places. Many spaces for me to go. Mm. Okay, let's go to that other door then. Oh no! Yay! Yeah! Oh, what is this? Why can't I move anywhere? This is not nice. This is not nice. I don't. I'm very limited in space. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna freaking die! Because game decided not to give me any room to move. Oh my god! Does my medicine do more? 90. Yes, please. Please don't. Please don't. Just don't. Just don't. Just don't. No, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I believe in you. You can find your way. Don't die. <laughs> Parasite powers have evolved. Detox. Removes effects of poison. That's nice. For anyone that's new here, that... Because we may have some new people that came into chat. This is Parasite Eve. This came out on the original PlayStation. Around the same time that the original Resident Evil came out. So, 1998 horror game. Very good. We just started it today, so you might have missed a little bit of story, but it's okay. No, 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 Pink in your area. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm poisoned. I want to kill the snake before I heal my poison because if I just heal my poison and the snake bites me again, then it's gonna be a silly waste of time. No, 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 
birdie, no, no, no. No, 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 birdie, no, no, no. No, angry pants, no. Oh, I took the junk, no! I don't want the junk. Take your junk back. <laughs> Take your junk! I don't want it. Um. Okay. Wants your junk. What's this door? They're giving me too many options of places to go and I do not like. You need a key, thank you. Limited my spaces, because then I'm gonna forget which way I have to go. Also, is there anything in trash cans? No? Okay. <gasps> You're a lion! Hi! Hi, hi. Bye, bye. You're very cute. Arrar! Bye bye, junk. <laughs> I don't want your junk. Oh, no. More snakies. No, 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 why did your brother die with two shots and you didn't? Uh. Okay. You're the older one, probably. Oh! I got a cure poison thing. That's nice. What are you? More bullet. More bullet, more bullet. What does this way go? This goes the way around the other side, I believe. Yes. But then, there's also this way, right? There's a puppy outside. He went arf arf. No, this is not a thing. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Why are you waiting? Did you know that you're cute? <gasps> oh, thank you. You're cute though, too. Chat is always cute. Everyone cute. Everyone. Ammo. Danger noodles. No ropes. Spicy shrooms. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Now. Was this lion something? Sometimes with these buttons, like you have to press it in the most right spot, or like it's a trigger. know if maybe there was a door I could have went in. Because this goes in a circle. That goes in a circle. That's just a chest. So there has to be something over here. Because the other doors are locked. And then this looked like a door, but I couldn't open it. Open. Open? No. No, open. I can't go to that side. Maybe down here? Hmm. Caution ramen. <laughs> Not the good ramen. I win everywhere. <laughs> this 
was locked. You need a key. Oh no! <gasps> up a walkthrough just to see where maybe there's a key possibly just so I don't like running around because I feel like it's a waste of time for me and you chat and I don't like running around trying to figure out where to go uh, because it sucks so I'm gonna look up really quickly parasite Eve walk through and go with a game facts because that's where we go. This is day two. Um, first floor, okay, okay. NYPD Museum, NYPD again, Central Park. Okay. Um, is there anywhere that says a key? Mm -hmm. Zoo key. Security station. Examine the drawer next to the computer for a zoo key. The same room where the, the dead body was. I just didn't know that there was a key. Yeah, a lot of old games poorly convey where they actually want you to go, so I always understand fully using that. Yeah, and it, it, it not only where to go, but things that are clickable are very hard to see compared to like other RPG-ish games where sometimes they give them a little shiny. And, uh, you, you can know that there's something in there. But... These... They don't give you... Like, a warning or anything that there's... A key. There's supposed to be a key in one of these drawers. I don't know which one. But there's a key somewhere. Where did it say? It's the next to the computer, I think? See? Come on! Like... <laughs> when I would have known that! And then you have to click so many times because you have to get it in like the most perfect spot. With these older games... I love older games so much, but those things are, like, so silly. Ooh, I'm level 10! Already! Already! Okay. But, it's been my three-hour mark. So I think I'm gonna let you guys go. I'll send you guys on the raid because I think Ramses is on. And, uh, it is his birthday and also their debut with their new model so i'm probably gonna send you the ramses but before i do i'm gonna ramble a little bit more no i know it's my three hour mark i always stop at three hours we just got here yeah happy anniversary month for you oh thank you yes it's the vtubers with disabilities year anniversary Gotta keep keeping the channel running. Yeah. Thanks for stream, CP. It's cool to see this game and learn with this. Yeah, I hope for the people that are unfamiliar with this game end up uh really having a fun time and coming back to see more of it because it's really good. 
and I'm really excited to play it. And we're starting Halloween season early because I can't wait until October. Obviously, I couldn't wait till like September either because I'm starting it a few days before September. But Parasite Eve is going to be on for every Wednesday from now on until we finish it. Uh, Friday, we might be most likely finishing Yakuza Kiwami Part 2, which I'm very excited about because once we finish that, we're going to be starting Eternal Darkness, which is another horror, all oldish game, which I'm very excited to play. So once we finish Yakuza, we're going to be starting that as well. And if I finish one of these pretty quickly, then... We might be starting uh, Silent Hill as well. A six-day Parasite Eve run starting on Christmas Eve would be fun. <gasps> that would be! Since this game is based on Christmas Eve, playing this on someone's channel like and doing a, a Parasite Eve Christmas Eve run would be really cool. Bye, Sheepy. was a good stream. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to send you guys to Ramsey. Which is uh, another member of the VTubers with Disabilities community. Because all month long with me celebrating VTubers with Disabilities, I have been sending uh, my chat to other people in the community. Our, our anniversary month is almost over. I'm so sad about it. But we raised so much money already for the Ellis Donald Society. If you don't know what Ellis Downloads is, uh, it's EDS for short, and it's a connective tissue disorder that affects your skin, your blood, and your joints. Uh, I am not currently diagnosed, but we are guessing that I have EDS for my joint issue, and that's why I have joint dislocations and chronic pain. Uh, I go to the doctors back in October. So hopefully I could get a diagnosis, but that's what we're raising money for, is for the Ellos Donos Society. And hopefully one day Ellos Donos would be more known and people like me who are trying to get diagnosis have an easier time one day in the future. And our goal was $200 because it was my first charity stream and I was scared that I was going to make the goal too high but obviously you guys showed me and shut me up connected tissue is what gets you can't trust it <laughs> yeah also uh, who we're sending you to to ramses they also have eds so we're sending you to someone who actually has the eds diagnosis but yeah it's Ramses, it's their birthday and their debut for their new model. Ramses' pronouns are he, him, and they, them, but they prefer he, him. I always like to tell you guys everyone's pronouns before I send you on a raid because it's important. And uh, also, if I send you to someone that you end up enjoying, please give them a follow because it supports us streamers very, very much and we appreciate it a whole lot. So yeah, I'll see you guys on Friday for the end of Yakuza uh, Kiwami Part 2. If you have not played Yakuza Kiwami Part 2 and plan on playing it one day and do not like spoilers, please do not come hang out on Friday because I don't want you to see any spoilers and uh, mess up your own gameplay. So if you plan on playing that game and do not enjoy spoilers, please do not hang out on Friday. I'll see you the following Friday when we play something else. And if you're interested in seeing more Parasite Eve, I'll see you guys on Wednesday. And then Monday, of course, is always uh, Persona 5 Royal. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for hanging out and enjoying this game with me. I love it so much and then I, I'm so excited to play it again because I haven't played it since I was 9 years old. So, I'm really excited. So, I'm gonna send you guys on the right now. If you like Ramsey's, give them a follow. And yeah. I can't wait to see their model. Their model's new and I haven't seen it yet. Well, I've seen a picture of it, but I haven't seen it, like, working. So I'm excited to see it. Anyway, thank you for hanging out. Enough of me rambling. I could go on forever. I'll see you guys all on Friday. Or Monday. Or Wednesday.
Okay. Bye bye. Give your give your, if you have petsies, give them smooches for me on the forehead. Yeah. Okay. If you don't have any animals, give your plushie a kiss on the forehead. If you don't have any plushies, what's wrong with you? Get a plushie. Okay, enough of me. Bye bye. Love you. Bye.